Hello, Leo. I hope you had a beautiful, relaxing weekend. This is Monica with Pisces Moon Intuitive. Leo, you want a soulmate reading to check up on the latest energies between you and your soulmate. First, as usual, we're going to ask what's coming up for you, what you'll be dealing with facing in your life, and how you're currently doing on your soulmate journey. Second part of this video, we're going to ask about your soulmate, whoever it is you're thinking of concentrating on while watching this video, whether you're currently in contact with them or not. Universe, please step in, show very clear and important messages for the sign of Leo, for Leo's highest good, please. Universe, please show us what's coming up for Leo in their life and how is Leo currently doing on their soulmate journey? What's coming up for Leo in their life? And how is Leo currently doing on their summit journey? Wow, you love your soulmate a lot, but you are very guarded emotionally towards them. You feel like this relationship is not working out for you, but you still love them. Yeah, you see the cups of love between the two of you are empty. There's no liquid. The love is not being expressed, shown. You are very reserved towards them emotionally. And you overworking yourself. This is you feeling tired, exhausted from your job. Yeah. Feeling stressed out, overburdened with responsibilities yeah you want a solid relationship with this person but you see that it's not going that way you see this you were hoping that this would end up being a long-term partnership with the soulmate that you love universe please show us i'm sorry you're going through so much leo uh let's see what's going on what's coming up for leo and how is leo currently doing on their soulmate journey. Yeah, you are very attracted, very drawn to this person. You have a lot of, you really are willing to reconcile with this person if they prove themselves to you. If they meet you halfway, you, you are willing to uh, reconcile with them for new beginning. You have a lot of stress from your job. Yeah. Ooh, somebody new showing up here for you. New person popping up here for you. Remember, Leo, you have free will to decide who you want, don't want to be with. Whether you want this person back in your life or be with a new person, be alone, that's totally up to you. You have free will to make those decisions for yourself. <clears throat> Yeah, the person you're dealing with is very slow to action. Yeah, they, they're not consistent in your life. It's like they give you mixed messages through their behavior. Your job is showing up here, stressing you out. Yeah, you feel tired. Ooh, new soulmate popping up so you are either about to meet the new soulmate or just met them <clears throat> yeah someone who is relationship material yeah the soulmate you've been dealing with is kind of wishy-washy in behavior slow to action but you love them deeply universe please show us What's coming up for Leo and how is Leo currently doing on their soulmate journey? Yeah, you're not sure where this is going, what's going to happen because you still love the person. But you feel, yeah, you feel disoriented. You feel like when you do talk to them, they really don't pay attention to what you're actually saying. You feel... Uh, coldness from this person, very reserved uh, demeanor from this person. Yeah, this is you feeling alone, sad, heartbroken. Yeah. 
So your heart wants to hold on to this relationship, hoping that some something will improve, change for the better. But your wisdom, your intuition, your sound judgment is telling you to let go. But your heart cannot let go. You still love this person. Yeah. You're dealing with a lot, Leo. Let's see what's going on with this soulmate of yours. The universe, please show us what is going on currently with that soulmate of Leo that Leo has been dealing with. And how is that soulmate of Leo towards Leo at this time, especially emotionally? What's going on currently with that soulmate of Leo? Yeah, you see, they don't communicate with you effectively. So they mourning some kind of relationship they were in or are in uh, that is not working out for them or hasn't worked out for them. They feel heartbroken. They don't feel they are good in, in commitment. Yeah. This means apologies, peace offerings. Yeah. It's like... They need to learn how to communicate effectively. Yeah. Something is going to happen in their life. Unexpectedly, shockingly, something is going to happen in their life. And this is like universe trying to kind of give them a nudge to finally get moving, do something. Not just sit there. You see this? Universe higher power is going to give them a nudge to kind of wake them up to life right yeah universe please show us wow um what's going on currently with that soulmate of leo that leo has been dealing with it's like they married to their job or business you see there's a lot going on in their life that you're not even aware of yeah there's a lot of shenanigans going on in their life they can be very stubborn, set in their ways. It's hard for them to apologize, admit to their mistakes. They can be ego-driven at times, materialistic. They like things, money, possessions. Yeah. Appearances, looks are very important to them. They do love you, but you don't feel loved by them. No. Yeah. So... There is a lot that they need to address in their life. A lot of things. Yeah, a lot of things they need to address that they have been kind of ignoring. Yeah, they love you a lot. Yeah, they do. They feel they owe you apologies, sincere apologies. But apologies are just words. They need to prove themselves to you through actions that are consistent, believable. Yeah, money, money, money is on their head, on their mind. Wow, this person needs to prioritize their life because money should not be the most important thing. Yeah, universe, please show us. Hmm. When we concentrate too much on money and things and positions, we end up being alone. Yeah. We don't know how to create harmonious relationships with other people. Yeah, because we are into material possessions and things and money and influences and recognitions and titles. Right? Yeah. Universe, please show us. What, this person loves you a lot, but they need to prioritize their life. Yeah. you matching the energy of the new soulmate, the king of wands, and you showing up as queen of wands. There's something they're not telling you, hiding from you. Something is being hidden from you. This person doesn't communicate with you effectively. They see clearly your worth value. Finally, they see how much you mean to them. Yeah. Yeah. Leo, we're going to go into your extended reading. 
Yeah, you see, this person needs to communicate effectively with you to be understood. They love you a lot, but what's missing here is open line of communication between you two expressing emotions yeah i like the new soulmate's energy yeah now popping up as king of cups both times as a king which means they are mature relationship material it's up to you leo who you decide to be with first however we're going to ask about the soulmate you've been dealing with their true long-term intentions and plans for you at this time what they're planning long term then we're going to ask what they currently hiding from you, whether purposely or can communicate for whatever reason, but the universe feels you need to be aware of for your highest good. And of course, at the end, we're going to ask advice for you on how to best handle the soulmate connection at this time. And anything else you need to know about your life, including new soulmate entering your life, the King of Wands, King of Cups, energy, new chapters, new beginnings in your life, also your health, finances, business, job opportunities, family matters, friendships, whatever it is you need to know, they'll show it at the end of the reading as well. So Leo, click on the extended link below this video in the description box below, and I'll see you there. Love you guys.